Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Uh, today I wanted to share with you the tote bags that will be going up in the shop tomorrow and let you know about the bag update. <laughs> so, it's going to be 16 tote bags uh, with pockets and snaps going up in the Etsy shop tomorrow, which is Wednesday the 27th. <laughs> Uh, at 12 p.m. Central Standard Time. That's my time here in Tennessee. Middle Tennessee. <laughs> um, that would be 1 p.m. Pacific, or not Pacific, Eastern. So if you live, you know, in the Eastern United States. <laughs> um, 1 p.m. 12 p.m. Central Standard Time. 11 a.m. Mountain Time. And 10 a.m. Pacific Time. So that's the West Coast. And about the other places I have no idea. <laughs> but uh, usually my, my bags are bought by people in those time zones. But uh, yeah, so I'm going to show them and tell you how many there's going to be. And they'll be up in the shop tomorrow. I can't hold bags for anyone. Uh, I've done that in the past, but it's just, it's confusing. <laughs> and also I don't think it's fair um, for everybody to get uh, a chance, not to get a chance to get the bags. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> I had to tell my Alexa to quit playing music. But anyways. Uh, yeah, so we're getting here. There's two of most of them. I think there's two of all of them except two. There's only one of them. <laughs> so, first is this cute, uh, like, denim print. It's like denim pockets. I haven't put the snaps in there yet, but I am. They're right here. <laughs> I just, I just literally got done sewing them, so, um, I gotta put the snaps in. But anyways, I got the long straps, and they do have pockets on the inside. I can't show it good because they're inside the bag. <laughs> But they get the pockets. The tags are on the inside of all these bags because I forgot to put them on the outside. And there's one bag that doesn't have a tag at all because I completely forgot to put a tag in it. So uh, I'll tell you that one when I get to it. <laughs> but yeah, so there's going to be two of these um, denim prints. Really cute with little flowers and lace. And there's going to be two of the mermaid ones. You guys already seen this um, in a video. <laughs> but it's, I got a pink inside. And then there's going to be, I love this one turtles. They're like sea turtles. I love the colors of this. It's blue on the inside. And there's going to be two of this really pretty blue print. A lot of people whew, showed interest in this print the other day. And it's like a dark blue on the inside with the pocket. It's just on the side. <laughs> uh, and there's going to be two of these with lighthouses and sailboats. This is a really pretty print. I love anything that's nautical. So I like that. And it's got like a nautical themed inside and it's pockets in there. <laughs> There's gonna be two of these Harry Potter ones. This is uh, like Harry Potter print but it says Gryffindor. They're red on the inside. <laughs> I thought that went good because it's Gryffindor's red. But uh, there's the those two of those. Two of this really pretty rose print. I love this print too. I love roses. It's also red on the inside with the pockets. And these two uh, are the ones that only have one of each. I didn't have enough fabric in each of these prints to make two. But there's this one that is puzzle pieces, but it's also autism awareness um, print. <laughs> so it's multicolor um, puzzle pieces and it's got red. And it's got the pocket, but this is the one that I forgot to put the label in at all. And by the time I realized I forgot the label, there was nowhere else for me to put it. <laughs> it was already sewn, you know, the whole bag was sewn together. Um, so that one doesn't have a label in it, but it does have pocket. And then the last one, I just saw a string on it, I gotta trim off, is this really cute cat print. There's cats like in a sewing room. There's other on the curtains. <laughs> that is so cute. And it's got a brown inside, and it's got the pocket and the label on this side. So like I said, I, got, I still gotta put the snaps in these. I always put one in the middle, like right there. And I try to match it as best as I can color-wise. I'm going to do that here in just a minute. i got to sit down. I'll watch some YouTube or something and put all those snaps in there. And so they're going to all be in the shop. There's 16. Pretty sure. <laughs> Pretty sure there's 16. Um, tomorrow, Wednesday, January 27th, 2021, at 12 p.m. Central Standard Time. Every update, I get people messaging me saying, hey, it's 12 o'clock. Where are the bags? But they're messaging me from other time zones. So um, I'm in Middle Tennessee. <laughs> so I'm not on the East Coast, but I'm like right beside the East Coast. So that's, um, in the East Coast, that is 1 p.m. because they're an hour ahead of me. And where I'm from, Central Standard Time is 12 p.m. Central Standard Time. And then on the other side, kind of in the middle of the U.S. is Mountain Time. <laughs> and that would be 10 or 11 a.m. Mountain Time. And then over on the West Coast, 
the Pacific Coast is um, 10 a.m. Pacific time. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that's the time zones that I have memorized. <laughs> But, um, I always, like, every, every update I get a message from someone saying that it's, hey, it's 12, where's the bags? And I'm like, it's not 12 my time. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I always try to put it up right around 12. I usually actually update the shop a few minutes before 12, but it takes, like, a few minutes for it to, like, refresh into the website. So, um, just start looking at 12 p.m. Central Standard Time <laughs> for, uh, the bags to pop up. But there's 16 of them, and then the next shop update, I'm gonna start working on those bags, uh, this weekend. They're going to be drawstring bags. I'm not sure how many there's going to be, just however many I can make before um, next week. Because I want to do a shop update around the 3rd. A lot of people have asked me to do shop updates around the 3rd. So um, the next one is going to be drawstring bags. An uh, unknown amount <laughs> right at the moment. But there will be a video before announcing it and showing you guys the prints. Uh, February the 4th, which I think is next Thursday. I think so. I think that's next Thursday. And it'll get it'll be 12 p.m. Central Standard Time. But uh, yeah, I got a, I got all my fabric pulled out in there. I got a little bit more I need to take in there, and I'm gonna um, see how many bags I can cut and make into drawstring bags before next week. <laughs> they they work up a lot faster than these bags, but um, we'll see. <laughs> I don't know. I'll try to make as many as I can so that people have more options to choose from. And then after this, I'm gonna have to start. I'm gonna have to go fabric shopping again because <laughs> I've used through a lot of the fabric that was gifted to me. I still have a ton of fat quarters, but I'm holding off on making bags with those until a day when, or like a time that I'm not super busy because they're going to take a lot more time piecing them together because fat quarters, you know, are smaller. So I'll have to uh, piece two together to make different front and backs. So it's really like four to um, make up some cute prints. I got some Star Trek and Star Wars and uh, I think some Disney ones and all that that people has gifted me and then some cute just solid like uh, colors and floral prints and all that and I'll, I, I know what I want to do with them <laughs> I just got to have the time to do it and I've been super busy lately but yeah so that's the shop update for tomorrow Wednesday January 27th 12 p.m. Central Standard Time <laughs> I always have to say that a lot because people always ask about the time but yeah I'm gonna go uh sit down in my living room and put all the snaps on these bags and take their pictures and get the listings all made and ready to go up tomorrow there will also be some amigurumis in the shop tomorrow not a lot maybe like four or five uh, I'm looking at my bag, but I can't see in it. It's over there. Every time I make an amigurumi that I'm not keeping or gifting to someone, I throw it in that bag. So after I accumulate a few, I'll just put them in the shop. <laughs> but uh, and then I do have some coming up. I want to make some more of those Mr. Perza lots because it's a really cute pattern. And I got some yarn up here that I want to use to make that. <laughs> my tower is getting really tall. <laughs> I need to uh, start using some yarn. But yeah, I also have this tower over here of all well, that 64 cent yarn. <laughs> I, I bought 12 of those and my sister went to her Walmart and got me, let's see here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, I think she got me 10 more. <laughs> so I got plenty of uh, those colors to work with. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and hop off here and get to work on these bags, get them all done. <laughs> and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.